Well, what do you say, Cap? Ready to get some work done today? Oh, I'm ready as ever. All right. Well, we've got a, uh, a big old harvester that we got to haul up north. And uh, unfortunately, we don't have a trailer wide enough to haul it. So we're going to double team it. That sounds like fun. <laughs> Yeah, I'd hate to tell you, yeah. um, we're driving semis today. We're not riding horses, but, uh, you know, you're ready for that occasion if it ever comes around, it, it looks like. Yeah, yeah, I, you know, just got off the ranch, so I, I, I figured we'd challenge the big horses today, so. Oh, well, we'll have plenty of horses under these, uh, the semis. Why don't we, uh... Fire them up, we'll do a little pre-trip, and uh, we'll get over to where we're picking up. By the way, guys, this is Captain. He is the guy who is making videos for Casually Pickled. Imagine Squad, Squad Farms with Stevio sort of deal. This is Captain, or me, and then yeah, Captain's doing the videos on Casually Pickled, like how Stevia does them for Squad Farms. You get the idea? Anyways, what I'm saying is you, go, is you should go and, uh, and check out his videos and let him know that you come from Pickle himself. Also, I want to announce that we are on the public roleplay server. That's right, the public roleplay server. Well, I guess just server in general. So if you want to get on and play some farm sim, then uh, the information will be in the Discord. So join the Discord to see that. If you're a YouTube member, then you do have access to the members exclusive farm on this server as well as well as a uh, future deal yet to be announced that I'll tell you guys about uh, whenever we get around to announcing that. But now, let's get into the video, shall we? All right, uh, you ready to roll? Everything looks good. I think I'm ready. All right, I'll just pull out here. We'll head over to the pickup location, and uh, hopefully traffic cooperates with us today. <laughs> the challenging part is we're going to have to line ourselves up perfect with. In fact, what if we... Yep, that's what we're going to do. We're going to back right up tire to tire. How's that sound? You know what? Let me uh, slot over here, and I'll take the... What would that be? Right side, passenger side here? Well, this is probably going to take us uh, about 60 attempts. <laughs> so once we get this lined up, I suppose uh, we'll get uh, it loaded up and on the road. Am I spinning? Yeah, you're spinning oh. a little bit, but you can get off it. I believe in you. There you go. I think we're going to need to close that gap, though. I think we're going to need to tighten her up a little bit. I want—I really want to get the tires centered and center here. You know what? I think that's going to do it, boss. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and strap her down. What do you say? I find a way that's easy to kind of do this is we're going to pick a cruise speed here. Let's say three. And uh, that's what we're going to time it down to pull out on. Okay? Have your lead here. But then once we get to uh, that right-hand turn, I'll take lead. So you go ahead, call it, or count it down, and uh, we'll go on, on three mile an hour. All right. You ready? I'm ready. One, two, three. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Now, one thing that we will see is that uh, sometimes the outer truck... We'll, uh, we'll have to bump up by about a mile an hour or so sometimes because of the way that, you know, you technically take a wider turn. But we'll see right. how that goes. Yo, you know what? I'm dragging my deal. Let's not talk about it. All right, right. now I'm going to start to cut it right here. Got that car. Hopefully the update let, ahead and, uh, let us take the turn. We're doing good. No cars coming for a little while. I'm going to tighten it up just a little bit here. Ooh, we're spinning. Come on. There we go. I'm going to keep tightening it up, trying to keep you on that pavement. There we go. Watch it, car. Let a fella turn. We're past it. We're past it. We're past it. There we go. Ooh, what do you think? First turn? Let's go ahead and lane up. So you lane, me a lane. Don't, uh, don't pull apart too much here. That's going to get annoying. Yeah, that's... <laughs> All right, there we go. And in the lane, we're going to hold it right there just like that. Perfect. All right, so I'm a little ahead of you, so I think if you go ahead and bump it up by a mile an hour here, we're going to kind of straighten each other out. Let's see here. 
Oh, I bumped it up by one. Let's see if I can go two. I think you're getting there slowly. Ever so slightly. All right. Well, um, you're about even with us here. What do you say we bump it up to six? Try and roll net that. Yeah, that works. All right. Pound it down. All right. I'm at six. You at six? I'm at six. All right. Well, we're rolling. If you feel like we can go faster, we can bump it up again here. I don't know. My trailer is starting to tilt for some reason. Well, it's that weight's getting on the edge of it. Do we want to stop right here and we'll uh, we'll reline up that that load? Yeah, we can. All right, go ahead and count it down to when you hit the brakes here. All right, three, two, one. There we go. Full stop. Looks good. Let's ramp down and uh, we'll we'll readjust that load. All right, Cap. We're coming up on a little town here, and we're gonna have a 90 degree right hand turn in front of the baseball stadium. That's gonna be a little difficult for us. Oh boy, 90 degree turn. Yes, like sir. This? Yep. Oh jeez. And if I'm not mistaken, we we might also have a little road construction to deal with as well. Well, that's always fun. But once we get through this, we're home free on the interstate for a majority of the rest of our drive. Should be very easy. All right, I'm going to hit a cone here. So I'm going to try and get on the inside of this white line just a little bit. That way I don't touch that cone. I can scoot over if you need it. No, we're good. We're past it. Alrighty. I think we're just going to have to take, you know, a good bit of both lanes through town here. All right, so we got yeah. a right turn here. In fact, <clears throat> let's slow her down to three. I'm, I'm slowing down now. There we go. Swing her to the left more. We're going to need a lot of room there. There we go. And I'm going to start swinging it right here. There we go. I'm going to be full right now. I'm going to turn her pretty tight. Ooh. Oh, I'm spinning out. Come on, truck. Come on, truck. Come on. No, don't spin out. All right, I think we're through. We're going to curb it a bit, but I think that's not really avoidable right now. But we snuck past the tree, and that's what matters. It looks pretty good. That was tight, man. Holy cow. Oh. All right, so we'll try and keep at least one tire of yours on the concrete <laughs> on the here. <laughs> I'll cut her a little narrow and we'll let the trailer dip into the, the soft land. But as long as your drive axles are on the pavement, we should be able to pull this thing through. All right, you know what? We're getting on the interstate. I think we can go ahead, bump it up, call six. Yeah, that works. All works right. for me. Moving up and there we go. There's six. And you know what? I think we can go more than that. You want to bump to 10? Let's try 10. Let's see what that does. All right. Up to 10. And that's 10. This is the first time I've ever done a load like this before. It was uh, different. I've done a few of them myself. I mean, I've done, like, transformers. Right. The big power transformers, but those are those usually fit on one trailer. Yeah, you're right. I'll tell you yeah. what, we can bump it up again or we can keep here. It's uh, completely your call. You want to try 15 and see sure. what we can manage, but... Yep, bumping up to 15 here. And there's 15. But I think we're doing good. You know what? I think, uh, I think we'll just tune in with everybody once we get to the destination. What do you say? That sounds like a plan. All right, Cap. We've made it to our off-ramp here. Alrighty. So, uh, you know, we're going to see if we can squeeze two semis woo, through this off-ramp. Did we want to slow it down to maybe like 10? Well, you know, probably smart. So let's go ahead and do so. 
All right, we've got a right-hand turn up here and two signs on either side. Um, I think we might take out a sign, boss. Uh, yeah. So, it just is what it is. And we'll, uh, we'll have a little bit of a lovely time. That's all. Yep. Maybe a little fast in that corner. Maybe a little fast, might be losing the load, but the good news is... <laughs> We're technically here. Well, boss, there we go. You go ahead and unload her. Um, it's practically unloaded already. Yeah, it looks like it pretty much unloaded itself. Well, you know, we did pretty good till the end there, but it's it's here and it's in one piece. That's what matters. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed the Standum Heavy Hall. Make sure you check out Captain or Cashly Pickled, as he's known on YouTube, in the description down below don't forget we would recorded all of this on the public server you can join the discord to see the information on how to log in to this server to play farm sim with your friends and until next time i'll see y'all later peace